La Xica. Good afternoon, this is the Plug Seeker. Um, I'm just doing a very quick uh, video. I'm just going down to check out a new rapid charger, uh, which is in Holford's uh, Centre in Redhill, which is only a short distance away. Uh, it's um, one of the Charge Point Genie rapid chargers, um, which I have used once before on a long trip down to Cornwall, but I've never um, used any local ones. And this is the first one that's uh, appeared in my local area. I'm going to just give it a quick go. As I understand it, the Charge Point Genie um, rapid chargers can only at the moment be activated using the internet website over the mobile phone. And they don't appear to ha um, have an app yet. I have used one once uh, when I was on a long trip down to Cornwall, I used a Charge Point Genie and we used the uh, internet on the phone and it worked fine. Um, so I'm just partly interested to see the new charger, uh, just check if it works, do a couple of quick photos for plug share and uh, maybe just a quick top up. I mean I don't desperately need a top up, I'm, uh, what am I, I'm uh, at 47% so I mean I'm, I've got plenty of charge left really but uh, it's just a quick scouting visit so charge point genie or CPS genie are not to be confused with another very similar sounding company which I think is just called Charge Point uh, and those are the ones um, the Instavolt are the Charge Points they are of different companies with very similar sounding names which is rather irritating so I'm just going to see if uh, this Charge Point Genie charger does work and see if there's any problems using the internet over my phone See if there's any signal issues and where it activates, relatively straightforward. Um, I noticed there are a couple of people who have done some check-ins on PlugShare. Uh, so far, so good. Um, so, uh, it's nice to have new networks being rolled out. I mean, uh, obviously the more the merrier. Uh, I believe also some of these charge point genies are cropping up at some of the petrol stations. Uh, which is good. As I may have mentioned, this one happens to be at a Horfords um, superstore of some kind. So we'll have a quick, oh look, um, so you can't see it, I just passed a BMW i3. I don't know if anyone else does the same, but uh, usually if I go past another EV, I usually give them a little wave or a flash uh, of the lights and uh, they usually do the same. I think we're still a bit of a niche club, so uh, we usually do tend to acknowledge each other when we're on the road. So just a couple of miles from here, we're nearly there. I'll also be interested today to see how the price compares. Um, honestly, I find that the prices are varying a lot and they do change. So whatever I might say on this YouTube channel right now, it could well be different in three months to six months time. But here and now, uh, in March 2018, I would say that probably my favorite are the Polar Ultra Chargers. Uh, firstly, for about eight pound a month, a full charge when you use one of them is about three pound, which is not much. Uh, and you can make up the difference in, um, you can make up the cost of the monthly subscription in probably about two charges. Okay, so this
this time I connected the Chadmo cable first and then I collected, selected the app and it looks like it's saying start so I'm going to say yes start all performing checks is making a sound with the car it sounds like it started and there we have it it's charging nicely okay so that wasn't too hard so let's have a look if I zoom in it's charging Okay, so at 50, roughly 50%, it's telling me that it thinks it would take about an hour to charge the full. Okay, well, we'll see. So I've got my car charging at the rapid charger, just in front of the Holfords Auto Center in Red Hill. Um, so as I said, this is the second time I've ever used a charge point Genie Rapid. Um, and one thing I just did learn is that um, you have to plug in first the uh, electric CHAdeMO or whichever charger you use, and then you activate um, the website. I did it the first time around the wrong way and I activated the red website first and uh, it said car not detected. So, in fact, to be fair, it is written in big blue writing on the front of the box, which I didn't bother to read. So actually no, so when you use the charge point Genie Rapids, connect the uh, charger first and then activate it using the website. It's a bit of a shame they haven't got uh, an app. Uh, so come on, charge point Genie, CPS Genie, hurry up and bring out an app for, uh, for the iPhone and Android. It's not rocket science. All the other, uh, most of the other uh, networks have got one. But actually that being said, if you go to the website on your mobile phone, it's a mobile adjusted website and you can just save. relatively straightforward um, only small problem is given that you can only uh, access it with your phone small top tip make sure your phone is well charged because uh, halfway through phoning my charge my phone wasn't plugged into the charger and uh, died and um, I mean I, I, the only way I could stop the charge then would be using the emergency stop which I don't really like to do unless I absolutely have to. So I had to wait for my car, my uh, phone to charge up so that I could uh, basically to uh, stop the charge. But um, yeah, no problem. So I would actually say that, uh, yeah, charge point genie. Um, second time I've used it, no problems at all. Um, it would be nice if they could uh, make an app. Um, I mean, I suppose it's not too much bother using an internet on the phone, but it, I don't know, it's, uh, I think just a little bit neater. If you can. So I'm pleased to have a new rapid charger within 14 minutes of my front door, which is uh, always a bonus. You never know when you might be on your way back home and uh, running a little low, let's say. I guess I must have been charging for about half an hour, something like that, maybe a little bit less than that. Um, and it's it went up from 48 to 85 percent in about that time so yeah half an hour stop didn't take long if i'd have gone in there with less than uh, 48 percent i imagine the earlier charging would have been even faster so anyway i'm gonna head back now um i think time for a nice cup of tea so i'll just uh leave you the sights and sounds of Catrium on the way back.